Hi, I'm Adrito, and this video is for people who are on the fence of whether they should apply to Oxbridge or not. I've made a separate video on the reasons why you should, but this video is for the reasons why you shouldn't. For context, I studied at the University of Cambridge for five years, and of course, I know a lot of people who studied at the University of Oxford as well. Reason one, it's difficult. I, like many people, struggle throughout my time in Cambridge. The terms are short, the courses are dense, and barely get time to do anything apart from studying. On the flip side, you do get to learn a lot about your subject, but if you want the chill university experience, this is not the place to go. Reason two, the bubble. I found that many people who go to Oxbridge, occasionally myself included, think they're God's gift to the earth. Just because you're good at A-levels and can study harder doesn't somehow mean you're better than anyone else. Maybe they didn't get the opportunity or they just got unlucky. It's perfectly possible. When I started working, I found that there were many people who went to so-called lesser universities who were way better at the job than me. This is something that the students need to learn. Reason three, the course might not be for you. For example, if you want to do straight physics, you can't do that in Cambridge because you have to do natural sciences. Or if you want to do straight politics, you can't do that in Oxford because you have to do PPE. Reason four, you might just not like the city. It's a very small town campus vibe. If you want a bigger city vibe like in London, Birmingham or Manchester, those universities are better for you. Plus, it's not terribly well connected. You basically have to go to London to get anywhere else. And if you live far away and want to go home frequently, then it's not great. Also, most colleges force you to take all your stuff back home at the end of term, which can be really annoying if you do live far away. Or if you're international and want to get to another country, you always have to go to London. Reason five, you're very much coddled. From cleaners to lack of cooking facilities to not being able to work. If you want independence, then this is not the place to go. You're basically still treated as a teenager in your early 20s. Also, if you go to a small college like Peterhouse, which only has about 70 people per year, everyone else in the college will know what you're up to. It might be obvious, but considering I've only given five reasons why you shouldn't apply and 10 reasons why you should apply in my previous video, I think for most people it's worth the shot. However, if you strongly believe in any of the reasons I gave in this video, another university might suit you better. If you want my raw experience of Cambridge, I did vlog throughout my five years there and a link to the playlist is given in the description. If you enjoyed this video or think you'll enjoy other videos of this style or you simply want to follow my life as a PhD student at UCL, a subscription would definitely be appreciated. Hopefully, I'll see you in the near future.